Any hit from my captains now will be a kill. Wait, there is a treasure here. And the X is to my left. There is a man at legs. I hope it's not that one, because I haven't really got a good spot to fight him at the moment. Oh, I still had uh, Olimar with me. It didn't look like he was with me. Pull everybody back, actually. Hang on. Dismiss here. I have a white. I will deal with that. I don't know why I have a blue with me. Seriously, I pressed dismiss and then just a random Pikmin decided to stay with me. Oh, the problem is he's in the middle of the room. I might have to fight that guy just because. He's in the middle of the room and the treasure's not in this room, so they would have to take it past him. It's that... I've got to fight two man at legs, effectively, and one of them doesn't even... It's not even, like, the problem. You better not wake him up. Oh, you could get electrocuted, though. One on the electricity, one on the poison. Do not wake him up, whatever you do. What was that when I was speeding up? Sounded not like that, did it? Funny how Nintendo gave Captain's help and no way to uh, heal themselves. They did in the first game, but for some reason you can't. Well, that's an extra bit of annoyance I do not need. Can BD kill fellow spot? No, sp fellow spiders cannot kill fellow spiders. Uh, that's that's annoying. Don't really want to fight this guy, but I've really got no choice in the matter. I was calling. I was pressing B. Oh, he's not going for the for the stomping. Oh my lord! Health bar deleted. Well, that was easy. Nothing. I'm actually glad it was nothing. I need to get rid of these electricity though. But but the more the thing is, if there are more speedy long legs in like the ceiling and stuff, while I'm running around to dodge the bloody um, the machine guns of the man at legs, I need to kill all enemies that are hidden effectively because that could cause even more problems. I just hope there isn't one here because that would be the worst kind of spot for it. This is also on a scale. Right. Take it slow. Nope, too early. There we are, right. Oh boy, right. Um, If he comes into base, that's scary. I might have to have everybody with me. I'm going to need raids. I need to take this guy out as quickly as possible. Keep yellows with me. Everybody hide against the wall here, because he's on that side of the room. It works the other way around. Man at legs can hit BD? Okay, but that's not as ideal, because this thing moves like crazy. Right. That's the time to flee. Uh, there we are. Hide behind this wall. Wait for him to start firing. I will say, this has made me a lot better at fighting the man at legs. And Ochi just makes it like so much easier in Pikmin 4. Like, it's disgusting like, how good Ochi is against this thing. But I don't think I'm going to make it this time without him popping off a couple of shots. Oh my lord. It's such a distance. Oh, stop shaking him off so quickly. I'm not getting a chance to fight him. It's not worth it. Yep. I'm going to lose some. I'm not going to get through this flawlessly.
No, oh, they're barely hitting him. <laughs> I'm not use yellows. I, d I could have done, but I've been trying to. I wanted to try and kill him quicker. I might have to use yellows just for the sheer fact that they'll actually reach. He's breathing. That's a good idea. I was going for attack strength. This is not good! This is not good! This is not good! Oh my god, I outmaneuvered him. Get fecked. It's because of these guys. I couldn't whistle them in time. Oh, get outmaneuvered. I'm surprised I didn't lose any on that one. That was so close. That could have ended terribly. I like how the music's still playing because there's still one around, but it's not woken up yet. That's actually even more spooky. Plus, the electric is probably better to deal with, uh, with what's this? Uh, yellows, excuse me. I was trying to use reds for the extra attack power. But I just was barely not reaching them. Can I forget they do that little foot dance. So, thinking I would have to take out two man at legs, I'm having to fight many other things freaking pilated again. Always have to turn up unannounced and uninvited. Try to deal with a spindly Johnny here. And a mechanized spindly Johnny as well with that. And you have to show up and be disrespectful. Don't need it. Can we kill? We can't kill. Damn it. You know what? I'm just going to go for it. There we are. Dead. Yeah, I'm... I, again, I don't know how I finessed the dodging on that, uh, Maria. That was insane. I, I'm actually kind of glad that I did that, though. I was, like, wincing the entire time. Like, ah! It's crazy. Uh, this freaking pilated, though. And all this... All these poison generators. This is even worse. I can't really fight the, uh... It's on a generator as well. I can't fight the man at legs in, under these conditions. Freaking pilated don't help. He's here... Wait, is it the pilated? It's not the man at legs, it's the pilated! Not what I was expecting! It's the pilated that has it! Okay! I don't need to fight the other man at legs. I just gotta deal with this disrespectful pigeon. Freaking serpentine's adoptive cousin. Don't peck me! Oh shit. Didn't even think about that. Late. Uh! He was getting smacked, but he still tried to move. Just knowing for the fact that I cannot get here is scaring the crap out of me. That didn't do any damage. Oh no! No! One landed in the poison and bounced on top of the man at legs! No! That's not fair! Shit! Oh, that's a problem. Now I have to deal with the man at legs. Mm, I've only got 16 yellows to deal with both of these. Where is he? He's hanging around his spot. I need him out of this room. Oh, his movement. I feckin' hate it. Stop going back to your spawn point. I want you in here. I can't deal with you and the pilot in the same room. I know you can go other places. You can't leave the room, can you? And this is right on the cusp of the, where the pilot would be. Oh, I hate this. But I did that at the wrong time. I didn't expect him to whip out his gun at that point. That one rogue Pikmin just bounced and landed on him, like, without even doing damage at that, he, he is, that, that, that's the one that accidentally woke him up, he's trying to make up for past mistakes, he's choking again, I can't save him, he's gonna get sniped, I think he drowned and didn't get sniped, I thought he was gonna get sniped, that's terrible, uh, god, he'll do more damage, 
and they lost their spiciness. Good lord. This is terrible. I can't get into the room, there's too much poison. I have to fight him on the cusp of where the freaking pilot eagle will be. No, get back. I'm losing Pikmin to the poison! There's some Emperors as well! If that means the one that bounced around and died woke them up and they're not going to go back to sleep unless I leave the room. I have to keep them on screen as they're doing it. Right, he's gone. There goes another red potion. That one needs to go to sleep. Can the man at leg shoot the pilated? I would like to know that. That would be useful knowledge. The Emperor's coming. The Emperor's coming. The poison's what caused this. As well as the pilot eat. You cheeky bugger. Right, the Emperor's gone. Right, that's less shit to worry about. At least I haven't triggered the pilot again, but... If the pilot it can be sniped, I would like to know before I take out the man at legs. Man at legs does have some freaky movement. I've seen it happen, but the same as BD is going to be stupid prediction. It's not worth it then. Might as well just commit to trying to snipe him. Get off him. No, it's not worth it. God, I'm just not doing enough damage to this guy. This is a completely unnecessary battle. Right, get him. Oh, no! Don't knock him off there! Oh my lord, no! Get out of there! Oh my god, I saved them. They got launched into the pilated, like, exactly where he was away, away from this corner, by the way. He, like, he predicts where you are underneath the ground. Like, he'll be in front of me in a second. I bet you. He'll be here. I mean, not exactly, but close enough. That's all of them. That did no damage, and they were spicied up as well. Like, what? He was also burrowing from, the, like, got stuck in the ground, like... This dude, like, takes so much abuse. Ah! I wasn't ready! I wasn't ready! Oh, God! They're dead. And he's gonna go for... No, he's not gonna go for the ones that are on the electricity. Oh, shoot. Could you... No. No. You are unfair! They are so far away! Power up. He's in the wall. I'm going for it. Pull him off. Why are you in the wall? Hey, he's dead. He fled while he was dead again. Why? Stop fleeing when you're dead. I have to hit you like another bloody ten times before you actually register as dead. Bloody chicken serpent bastard. Give me that coin. We're out of here. The Seas Pikmin have been avenged. Hello, you snuck on me since you were going live again. Again, I posted it on your server a day in advance. One Piece is real. Yes, it is the one. <laughs> what is happening now? This scale is down. What is your problem now, guys? Come on. Oh. Where's the other side of the scale? It's behind this wall. No. Wait, what? Where's the other side of the scale? It's in the bloody Emperor's corner, isn't it? Uh... Got to lower the block to lower the block. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Because I have done it. <laughs> Alright, I know what I'm doing here. This is going to be bloody fun, isn't it? Uh, that's the button. Okay. Going to have to do some classic speedrunning nudging. Wait, does it not work in this game? Doesn't look like it is.
All right, I got a better plan. Over here, guys. Pick me up. Seriously? No, this isn't working. Shit, what? This is dumb! So I need to be cheeky, walk around these guys, trigger this. I can't believe I need to do this. This is beyond dumb. I should not be entering this corner because the game's being fussy. Right, now I've activated that. I can then push this down again. Now it's on the goddamn floor. Now pick up the coin and get out of here. Seriously? There we go. Why did I have to do that? That was not necessary. It was already down. Like, how did we get there to begin with? Alright, that was a bit of a pain in the arse, but we got it. The Lustrous Element. That's one more piece that we need. Uh, just give me a handful of reds. Alright, that will speed things up. Bash, bash, bash. Crash, bash. Open the exit. No one locked onto the exit! What? How? That is impossible. We were surrounding the damn thing. They walked around it and stood there. My Pikmin just want to die, honestly. They just want to be in the ground, 28 floors deep, and just die. Because they clearly don't want to leave. Also, I had to bash my way out of that one. The, the hubris of my Pikmin just not listening to my commands is beyond silly. Like, you go idle, and you lock onto whatever's nearby, and they just don't, like... Alright, well, it must certainly be floor 30 that's the end of this, so we're almost done. No cave music again. Fucking pilot in Sanagra again. At base. I was listening to try and think, hang on, water rave, but I haven't heard one land. Instead, it's that bloody disrespectful pigeon. But then, as you pointed that out, Paddy... Well, no, because even when music is not playing, the bat, the boss music doesn't play. But that's playing. There can't be a hidden water wraith on this floor, surely. Right. Gotta kill this guy again. Because he's just gonna be guarding this entire room. Come on then, you son of a bitch. I thought we just dealt with this. I'm not doing any damage and I'm spicy. Get on his head, there we go. Now we're doing damage. Almost in the poison there. God, I might be getting a second. He's just continuously popping up like a whack-a-mole. Well, uh, we're getting more damage. Screw you, mate. How dare you? There we are. That'll kill him. Do not burrow back under the ground, thank you. The panda is back! Oh, he be looming. I see they're looming. Wow! Okay! Change of Pikmin. We've got another spider to deal with. Happy days, right, power. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. And there is the blurps. If you wanna play if you wanna play any sounds, uh, type in blurp, sign in with YouTube, and you can earn channel points when watching the stream. One, 
Hey. Everybody on him. He has to take four steps now before he decides to shake him off. That's tons of damage. Okay, that was three steps, actually. Excuse me. I know your pattern. Don't start changing it now. One. Two. I had to move. It's going to get stomped on otherwise. Got him off the right time. All just to get out of this bloody cave, which is over there, by the way. He's steaming. I could probably have left them on there, but then we've got knocked out. Camera, don't do that weird jitter thing. He's dead now, so we don't have to worry about this guy anymore. Bye bye. Open up like a ball of confetti. Alright, they didn't freak out my Pikmin either, which is very nice. Right, so we need to get over there. I'm taking the uh, the corridor. Alright, so that's good news. Is there a Kaiser for Pikmin 3 and 4? I'm not entirely too sure. I don't even think there's a randomizer for 3 at the moment. You kind of have to, like do it yourself manually or someone has to do it manually in order to give it to someone so it is basically said ran it's basically random so I'm not tie too sure I don't even know if there's a bit more one Kaiser there probably is all those spiders filled with my tights I'm not I don't know so f it's only been the raging so far but the thing is is that Paddy said that there was no music but now it's constantly playing the boss music but normally when there was no music, it would spawn water wraiths, but now, knowing that this is the Cave of Trolls, I have no idea if there's supposed to be a water wraith on this floor, but... Hasn't it not already been more than five minutes? Wouldn't one have dropped down at this point, if they didn't drop down immediately at the start? Or is it, like, a trap and I need to trigger it? So if that's the case... Full Mars will be the randomizer. Eh. Oh yeah, because uh, Pikmin 3 does have the Ultra Spicy. What's the point of that? Hmm. 20 likes to do with George's Mask Cow Station. Don't you start getting things into people's heads. We haven't hit 10 likes yet. Don't you dare. YouTube Mobile is so crap, it keeps pausing the stream. I'm looking at these corridors being blocked by whites, effectively, and I'm thinking... There must be... Is that a trap water wraith? Well, Paddy's... I think... I don't know if Paddy's trolling or not, but then again... If they weren't in the chat, why would they... They would never have said something, so I don't know. Spread the word. <laughs> yeah. Well, I might have to check out the, the new Ocarina of Time Chaos first, you don't know. But we need to finish this first, like, this has been way overdue. Even worse so than Ocarina of Time Chaos Edition, Kaze's version, the original. So, you know. Probably need a Pikmin with me, hang on. There's nothing here. I don't think there's a water wraith. I think I'm tricking myself out because Paddy just happened to say something and I was like, ah. I think I'm trolling myself. Because it should have appeared at some point. I don't think they can actually be traps. I've never seen a water wraith be a trap. I don't think it can be a trap. They're always programmed to drop in. And that's, like, after a certain amount of time, that's specified. Five minutes for the normal game or something, and basically on spawn for this. It's always been basically, like, ten seconds upon spawn or something. I mean, it's also always... Oh, it's being blocked by bolt oh, emperors. Hang on. Oh. Damn it, I triggered him. Run. <laughs> Whoa, what the heck? Why did I get launched after he popped out of the ground? Should have got launched as he did. What was that? Hey, turn around, please. Go back to sleep. 
Hopefully I'll be back later off to do some grocery shopping. No worries, Maria. Thank you for hanging around with the stream. Have a good day shopping. Go back to sleep, please. Thank you. Oh. God damn it, Ed. Right, I'm going to need literally less than five or something. Don't trigger him, don't trigger him, don't trigger him. There we go, right. In the corner, everybody on the wall, do not spread out too much, whatever you do. Water waves are kind of funny. If you defeat one at like floor one, they never show up again, even if they're referenced later. Oh, so since I killed them all on the first floor, they're not going to show up ever again. Fair enough, then. But that, that makes sense, actually, because that's why you see the rollers. And because even if you don't defeat them on an earlier floor, that's why the rollers show up later anyway. Why?! Why do I have to toss you onto the exit in order to you actually work on the exit? They don't even do it when you swarm them. Or dismiss them. I don't get it. Like, they just stand there doing nothing. Alright. Floor 29. I believe the semi-final floor. And we're missing one more treasure. So, let's see how this goes. We've got a decent supply of Pikmin. There's nothing here, so it must be the next floor. Exit is just over there, and I don't see anything in that room, so it's either, once again, pilated snaggots or a bunch of traps that are going to be snitch bugs or s spiders again. Oh, I've been piled by a panda man. I know it's panda. I see you. They are looking around after they got rid of that wall. I saw that. There is something waiting. There it is. Well, it's borrowing, not a pilated, so that's different. So it can't chase me, which is very nice. Could have referenced Wraiths three times in this cave and you wouldn't even know it. Well, I have seen rollers on some floors already, so... But, yeah, no Wraiths actually showed up. I need to get past this wall. They're not close enough, I don't think. I'm going to hang around here and see if we're good. He turned? Cheeky bastard. Right. Anything appearing here? Are we good here? Are we good here? Are we good here? We're good here. Right. They could be in the way, though. Don't like that. Freaking serpentine of pigeons there. Right, this is when we're going to go. Everybody on the wall. There we are. The exit's right there. That is close. That's good. Right, this wall's gone. Right, this is where it gets scary now. We don't know what could show up trying to get the exit here, and it is right in front of me. Good lord, stop that. I'm trying to... I think I'm going to have to fight this one. Because this room's going to be filled with them. That's a good spot, right. Scout. Why did they all go for him? They were nowhere near him. Oh, feck off. Oh, this dumb. Well, now I'm in this situation because my Pikmin once again decided to be stupid. Well, now we most certainly have to retreat, which shouldn't have even been a bloody problem in the first place because my Pikmin decided, you know what? We were safe. We're going to just run towards this guy for no apparent reason. Thanks for being stupid again. Make my life more bloody difficult. They were fine, and they decided to not be fine. There was a reason why I put you here. So that did not happen. Stupid fecking. The electric fence here does not help. Why did he attack with that many Pikmin on his head? Excuse me? Why do these things just break the rules? Like, they, they spawn in walls. Well, very early on in the game, they were spawning in walls. And I'm losing all my blues because of this. It's so stupid. How many more hits when you were dead? Right, the pilated shows up on my left, so... As long as I can avoid the pilated... 
thing is, I have to toss them onto the exit for them to actually work on the exit. Right, well, we're good here. Even though that blue is dangerously close to the poison. He is literally guarding the exit. I don't like that at all. You son of a bitch! No! You were closer when you were there and you didn't go for a peck! How did he get me from there? Why is it when they're closer to me, they don't do the damage that you expect them to do? I hate Snagrits. I hate Snagrits. I was so close to the end and the, the, it all got messed up because my blues decided, you know what, I'm going to walk into death for no reason. Like, I left them there for that reason, so that didn't happen. Well, I hope this is 30 floors. You have so little health. I know. Him. I got flattened by a boulder. That one. Why am I spawned on top of a scale? It's going to be further away now, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm, that was good. That was such a good loadout. It was right there. And my blues had to be stupid. Like, I blame my blues, honestly. I had to run back and save them. I put them in a spot where they were safe. And then they just decided to run at them. That's what I'm really mad about. Look at this! Like, at the bloody entrance. Well, they're not safe there, I know that for a fact, because the bloody pilot can jump. Right, I need to scout the, the route I need to take. That's actually kind of worse, because it's not even in that direction. It's up there. Well, I need to take... I need to actually fight this pilot this time. I haven't got many yellows left. This is dwindling my yellows. It's pretty much joy. The thing is, I can't fight one if the other one's going to devour my pigment. Great. He just triplicated. I'm not dealing with that, no. I already ran through that room, and there was only one Snagrit and one Pilated Snagrit, and then all of a sudden, he just sprouted an extra two heads. You're kidding me. This ain't bloody mitosis. Lay some eggs. You're both Serpent and Buzzard. You can't, you're not just the freaking Snagrit Hydra. I mean, I'm surprised they haven't even made that a thing in Pikmin. I mean, I guess it's close, because the first time you see the Snagrits, that's in a group of three, but, like, they're not all spawned in the same spot, you know? 